Does does anyone remember last year I made a video about Sarah Palin's son basically uh, stepping on their family dog and she was going after PETA for going after her? Well now Sarah Palin's son basically is double da basically got himself arrested for violence against his wife and he's basically PTSD. Sarah Palin went and blamed him when she was doing a tour rally in Tulsa, Oklahoma. And now, basically everyone going after her, she says this. Palin. I gotta get my Palin voice for her. <clears throat> I can give her blame to Obama for PTSD. The former governor, Alaska governor, Sarah Palin, insisted on Monday that she never blamed the president, Barack Obama, for her son's recent arrest for domestic violence charges. Oh, really now? Stumping for Donald Trump's last stumping for Donald Trump last month, Palin alluded to her son's arrest earlier that week that suggested that the Obama did not respect and honor military service members in returning home from duty. What my own son is going through what he is going through coming back, I can relate to other families who feel ramifications of PTSD and some of the woundedness that our soldiers do return with she said at Trump rally in Tulsa, Oklahoma, a day after endorsing Trump. And it makes me realize more than ever, it is now or never for the sake of America's finest that we have a commander in chief who will respect them and honor them. <sighs> See, this is what I mean. Really? You're going to sit there and tell me that you never blamed Obama, yet you're saying that basically Obama doesn't respect him. Technically, yeah, you are. In, you're basically, yeah, you are doing this. You are blaming him for your son's PTSD and you think that Obama doesn't honor and respect them honor and doesn't respect the soldiers really it was your own fucking party Sarah that basically thinks that that, that, that thought that Jade Helm was a government army takeover that was going to take over the US and basically take and just ruin Texas and all that shit it was your fucking party that believed this shit and now you're going to sit there and tell me that Obama doesn't respect the... the now you're going to sit there and tell me that Obama doesn't honor and respect the freaking troops? Give me a break. And the only reason why you're going, you're supporting Trump now, Sarah, is because, oh, it's a perfect opportunity to get me back in the limelight again. Hell, ever since last year, I don't think I've ever freaking saw you in the news until now. It's about freaking time you did something stupid. I mean, this is so freaking stupid. You are an idiot. You, Sarah Palin, are the most idiotic woman I've ever seen in politics. And it's funny, too. You say that the Democrats and Obama does not respect your... That, that, that does not respect the troops. Yet, whenever they try to... Yet, yet the people... like And yet, the freaking veterans that try to get help when they come home... They're treated like shit from people in your party. That's it. So yes, stop blaming Obama for your son's problems, Palin. When it's really your own party's fault. Yeah, this is the party that supposedly supports the troops, yet when they're trying to do military practice in Texas and all over different like places. Oh no, 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 it's a government takeover to take over the state of Texas even though that Texas is already a part of the United States of America. Give me a fucking break with this shit. Sarah Palin, you are the most idiotic person on this planet. And you should be ashamed of yourself and just go away. God damn it. I'm Crazy Pain 93. I'll see you later. Bye.